Hi DIYers, Joe here from Alarmgrid, and today we're going to talk about how many hardwired zones are on a Lyric security system. The Lyric system itself can support up to 128 wireless zones, and it can also support two hardwired zones. Now if you have the Lyric system at home, you may have noticed that on the back, on the terminal block, there's actually three terminals that point out these hardwired zones. Let's take a look. Right down here, this is the terminal block that you connect the power to on the system. And you'll notice that these three terminals right up here, it says HWZ1, GND, and HWZ2. These are pointing to the two hardwired zones on the system. With your hardwired contact, the wires, they're basically gonna run back to the system and depending on whether you wanna use zone one or zone two, you're gonna land the wires on the respective terminals. Both of the zone wires are actually gonna to connect to the ground lug, and that's perfectly fine. You just need the two wires from the zone that you wanna use on the H HWZ1 and GND, or an HWZ2 and GND, and they'll work just fine. Let's take a look at programming and see what it looks like to set these zones up. <clears throat> so if we look at our Lyric system right here, your system may be on this screen, or it may be on this screen. If it is on this one, click on Security, then click on Tools, and then enter the installer code. Ours is the default, so we're going to enter 4, 1, 1, 2. Then click on Program, then click on Zones. Now, the two zones right here on the top, 1 and 2, these are actually pointing to the hardwired zones on the system. So let's say we have our zone wires landing on HWZ1 and G and D. That means we're going to program zone number 1 on the system. So if we click on number 1, and then click on edit. It looks just like any of the other zone programming screens on the system for programming the wireless zones, except it doesn't have the RF options as it's not a wireless zone. You can set the zone descriptions right here. You can change the device type. You can change the response type for the zone itself. And then supervision, you can have the system look for a end of the line resistor if you have one connected, or you can have it look for a contact that's normally closed or normally open without a resistor. So however you have the zone set up, you can configure it uh, to work just fine. With this set the way you want, go ahead and click Save. That'll save the programming for the zone. And then assuming that you wired it correctly, it should start working as soon as you back out of programming. Now there's a few other options that you have if you want to interface hardwired zones with the Lyric security system. One of the more popular ones is the 5800C2W. This device here lets you land nine hardwired zones onto it, and then all those zones can be programmed into zones on the Lyric. This is really commonly used when a person is taking over an existing hardwired security system with a Lyric, as you can just take the old system down, you can install this right in the existing box, land all the existing hardwired zones to this device, and then they program wirelessly to the Lyric itself. It works great. Just know that you're going to need a, a backup battery for this, and it does require a power transformer that it does ship with. The backup battery is not included with the 5800C2W, so you will want to order one on the side if you do pick this up. And it uses a 12 volt backup battery. Another device you can use to interface a hardwired zone with the Lyric is the 6CT, the original one. This is the box for it right here. Here's the contact itself. This has a magnetic reed switch that can be used to work. So it, when it's next to a door or window, the magnet moves away from the contact. The system knows that it's open. It moves back. It knows that it's closed. The nice thing about this contact is that it also has hardwired terminals on it. So if you have a hardwired contact, you can actually run the wires to this itself. And then this will wirelessly transmit the information to the Lyric system super convenient to use and sometimes if you have a strange install or an area that doesn't really let you install a wireless contact to use with the magnet, running a wire to a hardwired contact and then connecting it to this can uh, be the perfect fix in one of those situations. Just like the 6CT, the older 5816 sensor, this is compatible with the Lyric system. It also has a magnetic reed switch, so it can work with a magnet, just like the 6CT. And it also has a hardwired terminal, so you can land a hardwired contact right onto it. 
The difference between this and the 6CT is that this is, does not work with uh, encrypted or encrypted communication like all the six sensors do, and it has a lower uh, communication distance or range than the 6 device. 6 devices have about a 300 foot communication range, the 5800 devices have about a 200 foot communication range. But these are really, really common. You may have some kicking around the house, and if you move into a new place, these may even be installed. So if you do find them and you can use them, by all means, they're, they're still great sensors to use. So that's pretty much how many hardwired zones are on a Lyric security system. If you did enjoy the video, feel free to subscribe. If you want to be notified about future videos, hit the notification button, and we'll send you an update when we do post them. If you have any questions, give us a call, send us an email, or head over to the website, www.alarmgrid.com. Thanks for watching the video, and we hope you have a great day.